This is Daniel Lange from uh, Copenhagen Voice and we are sitting here with Elena Pecci, an Italian artist, in her studio. Uh, Elena, we have some questions for you uh, about your paintings. For First of all, I would like to know that when did you start painting? Uh, I guess it was when I was uh, a child, <laughs> because uh, I remember when I was uh, yeah, five, something like that. Uh, all my walls were full of my drawings and uh, my books uh, and uh, my furniture as well and uh, yeah. Have you ever been to an art school? Yes, I was in an art school while I was studying graphic and photography and then art and uh, we had session where uh, we were drawing for hours and hours and yeah, and painting and Focus, actually we were focusing on drawing and then... What is your favorite color? Uh, I think I have three favorite colors, uh, which is blue as you can see. And in, um, actually blue is always the, the base of, for my painting. Uh, and then yellow and red, they are actually the primary colors. Uh, the colors that are easy, easily used by children and uh, they are representing like, the sun, the energy, or uh, red, the um, love, uh, uh, blue, uh, like freedom and um, water and yeah, they, they remind me the elements, the basic elements. What do you want to express uh, with your paintings or what are your thoughts? Yeah, actually I want to express the um, energy. Uh, of the woman, basically, and uh, connected with the environment. And uh, that's why I use so many women and um, I, yeah, and people. I'm focusing on people and their, um, uh, in their uh, dreams, their uh, doubts, their uh, wish. So I use myself or the representation of a statue or a woman for. Um, um, I use my experience, and through those, I I paint uh, what uh, what I think, uh, what is my philosophy, what is my interpretation of life, and then so people can like mirror on it. Do you have exhibitions or galleries? Yes, I have an exhibition in a gallery, but um, I prefer to make my exhibition in cafes or restaurants when I can. Um, be really in contact with my potential customers and uh, I find the best way where people can enjoy their coffee, their their freedom, their, their free time and um, at the same time enjoy my paintings. I'm curious about your future plans for the coming 10 years. So uh, what do you expect from life? Um, I. At some point, uh, I think I would like to <laughs> get married and have uh, children. So um, I expect for myself to paint a lot uh, until that time. So because I know after it will be a bit uh, difficult. But uh, and I, I always have the urge to paint. I need to paint. So um, um, my future plans are paint. Uh, yeah, paint a lot. And uh, uh, it would be fantastic to find really a gallery where uh, I can promote me continuously, but this requires to work a lot and find time. And uh, at the moment I'm studying. <laughs> so, but um, yeah, uh, I'm sure uh, I can continue to make exhibitions and paint. Okay, so Alana, we can see that you are using lemons on some of your paintings. Uh, do you have a specific idea or thoughts behind it? Yeah, <laughs> of course. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, first uh, I use lemons and orange and apples and just because I want to represent my origins uh, from South Europe living in north in the north uh, europe uh, is like my roots my roots are <laughs> suddenly <laughs> um, 
appearing. And um, yeah, actually I want to represent the different uh, um, options we have in life. And I started to use lemons exactly because uh, at that time uh, I wanted to represent a situation where uh, I thought life can be a bit sour. Is it your hobby or your passion to paint? It's not anymore my hobby. <laughs> it's really my passion because I feel like when I don't paint, I feel like I don't eat, I don't drink, uh, drink water. <laughs> um, um, it's really something I have to express. So it's not, yeah. But it's also my work now because uh, I make exhibitions. So. Uh, some people want to buy or they ask for painting so I need to replace it and uh, I need time I need to find really the right mood and uh, it, it doesn't feel anymore so relaxing to paint I need to uh, that have deadlines and uh, if I don't, I don't paint then I cannot exhibit thank you so much for for the chance to make an interview <laughs> with you thank you very much thank you thank you